The Otago Nuggets began their season with an unexpected run of wins, a turnaround for a team that struggled. ODT Sports reporter Adrian Sacconi has documented the team's highs and lows and he joins us tonight. Good evening. How long have you been following the Nuggets? I started reporting on the Otago Nuggets for the Otago Daily Times in 2005. Um, they had a season on the sidelines in 2009, cited financial reasons for not being able to field a team that year. So I guess this, guess this makes this my ninth season and definitely the most enjoyable for mm. I've had a, a good run this year. How has the journey been? Oh, it's, it's kind of been like a roller coaster with no peaks, to be fair. There's been a, a lot of lows in that time, but of course they've managed to turn it around this year. Uh, I guess one of the lows was in 2009 when they went part of the league. Now, the franchise was at its lowest in 2009. Tell us a little bit about why, what happened? Uh, it, it basically came down to a lack of will, I think, to continue to prop up uh, the, the franchise financially. They'd run out of money. It was a, a big drain on basketball at Targo. There wasn't the will to keep uh, putting in the funds, I guess. They wanted to put it in development. I think it was a mistake because that just gave promising players in the region nothing to aspire to. Um, there was a change in the board, and we saw a change in, I guess, uh, priorities and the team got up, back up and running the next year with a lot of help from the community so it was, it was a good news story in that sense. Mm. But an incredible turnaround this year, what do you think has been behind the, the turn? Uh, well, the National Basketball League is a semi-professional league so usually the team with the most resources uh, assembles the best roster, they have the most success. The Nuggets have definitely lifted their game off the court this year. Uh, the amount of corporate tables at the games are have uh, probably increased by 50%. Uh, the crowds have increased. Um, oh, they've just got uh, greater streams of revenue. The return of Mark Dickel is probably another key there. He's uh, a guy with a lot of mana in the basketball community and he's been up to lure players to the region and um, <coughs> got a better roster, better players, better results. But the team does appear to have had a few wobbles in the last few weeks. Yes. What do you think's happening there? Yes, they have. I'd like to say pass, but it's not a game show, so I'm trying to provide an answer. Defence, I think. Defense, it's all about defence and basketball. The Nuggets, when they started and when they were playing well at the beginning of the season, their defence was uncompromising. Uh, they were the best in the league. They've dropped significantly. Uh, and defence, thankfully, is one of those things that can be changed. It really comes down to attitude. You don't need the precision or the execution that you do on offence and defence, so it just comes down to a bit more application, I think, that... All teams have their peaks and troughs. I know it's trough, it's come at a bad time though. Well, we'll watch the space. ODT Sports reporter Adrian Zaccone, thanks for your time.